Hi, I'm Shelly Bett with ChildCareLand.com and today I want to share with you a fun and easy science experiment that you could do during a flowers theme. Um, you just need white carnations and I just purchased these at a flower store. Sometimes they have them in grocery stores as well. Um, they're cut flowers and you'll need to have plastic cups, water, and food coloring. And basically what this experiment does is it shows children how the flowers drink up water from the bottom of the stem all the way through to the leaves. And to start the experiment, you'll need to have your cups out. We use just clear plastic cups. And I put a cup each of water, or a cup of water in each. And then to the water, I add about 30 drops of food coloring. So you can choose a color of food coloring that you want to use. Um, there's some colors that work better than others. I think green is about the slowest. So you would add 30 drops into each cup of water. And it doesn't have to be exact, but the more the better, the, the, the better the um, color will rise. Right. And then you want to take your flowers and usually when you purchase them they're very long and again these are carnations but you want to have it so it's pretty you know pretty short up sticking out of the uh, cup and you always want to make a fresh cut and these I bought yesterday and I let them dry out a little bit so they're going to be pretty thirsty today. And you just make a cut at an angle and you stick the flower in. And then the children observe the changes over time as to what happens to the flower right now all the petals are all white and sometimes it can take a few hours up to 24 hours for the the color to come oops, for the color to come through to the petals of the carnation so you just leave these um, in the area that's pretty safe and children can observe the changes when they walk by you know explain to them that these aren't to be touched the cups that are or the flower petals right now just let them soak up the water and that's how they get their food is that they soak up the water in through the stems and up to the petals. And then after a few hours, you'll start to notice color changes. And these I did red and green. And I don't know if you can see it too good, but these are no longer white. This is red, like a pinkish, and this is green. And if you look at the tips of the flowers, that's where you can see where the color has all started to go to from the food coloring that's in the water. And the same thing with the green one, if you look on the edges of the petals, the food coloring has come all the way through the stem, all the way through the petals, and now out to the edges of the, the petals. So this is really just a cool experiment, experiment, and children get to see a lot of changes with the petals. Also, it's good to tell them that um, the food color does not hurt the plant at all. And um, maybe talk about maybe pollution or things that bad things that are put in water that, that, that does get soaked up into the wildlife plants as well. So we want to be careful what we put in our groundwater. For Color Changing Flowers, I'm Shelly LeVette with ChildCareLand.com. And thanks for watching.